Welcome back friends, Mark here. Today I'm making a video which is pretty much in response to the portable jump starter right here like for a vehicle. This is the DB Power. I've also reviewed the Stanley jump charger, portable battery. And people have asked me, is that something that can charge your battery? And I keep saying no to them. It's only, these are just meant for the time that your battery is pretty much dead. You clamp them on, turn it on, and it should start. But if you have a fully dead battery and you need to bring it up to full charge, then you need to look at a different product. And that's what I'm gonna show you today. So I have two different products right here that will fully charge your battery. It's not gonna give you like the instant jump start. At least this one won't. That one has the feature. This one runs about $45. This is made by Die Hard. It's a three amp charger and battery maintainer. So the maintainer is if you're gonna leave your car just sitting for several weeks at a time, you can plug this in and it'll just keep your battery topped off. This is the other one that I have to show you. This is approximately $95. This is by Die Hard and it offers several things. It's a two amp for slow charging, which is slow trickle charging is the best way to charge your battery. The fast isn't quite as effective, but when you're in a hurry, you might not have a choice. It has 10 amp, it has 20 amp for rapid, then it also has a engine start. I really don't ever use that. It seems like I tried it once or twice and I didn't really have a lot of luck with it. I'm gonna show you how these two work real quick. This battery on the truck's kind of old, so it's probably not fully topped off. So we'll get an idea how these two work. So let's take a closer look. Okay, the first one is the Die Hard, the smaller one. All right, I have a red and a black, so you hook those up accordingly. Red to red, black to black. And you plug it in. You'll see the code there talking. It analyzes the battery for a couple of moments. Still analyzing it. Usually three times, and then it'll start charging and tell you what percentage it's at. All right, now it's charging. It's at 82 percent. And then when it's topped off, it'll just say 100 percent maintaining. So I could say that this one at $45 is a really good deal. It's going to take you a little longer if you're in a hurry. The fact that it's 3 amp isn't going to be as fast. Like if you like maybe have only 30 minutes to top off a battery to a certain percentage so you can get moving and get on the road. But this right here will work well for you. So, all right, so there's one issue that I've come across with this. When your battery is like so far gone, you might have some dead cells in it. I have found that this, at a certain point, won't charge. It'll just, it'll go through and analyze it a few times and they'll say like, error, and it, it just won't charge it. Where I found this one will still charge it. So one time I was stranded at work and wanted to charge a battery that's completely dead and the jump starters didn't work because it was so far gone. But I was able to pull it up with this full enough to a charge to start it to drive somewhere to get a new battery. All right, so now I want to demonstrate how the Die Hard Platinum works. Do the same thing, black to black, red to red. Plug it in. And this will show you where it's at right now, 12.3. Let's zoom in a little bit. See how some of these features work? All right, so if I want to charge it, I go to the charge rate right here. It's a regular battery. It'll also do deep cycle or a gel battery. So if I go to two amp to start, this one has a slightly different reading than the other. This says it's at 70%. If I'm in a little more of a hurry, I push it again to 10 amp, it'll go fast. So we're charging now 72%. It'll probably be a couple more hours yet before it's topped off. So I'm gonna wrap it up here and say between these two, 
you can't go wrong at $45 this will charge your car or truck battery, a tractor battery, lawnmower, things like that. This one at 95 is going to give you more options. So if I had to, to choose between the two, I'd probably go with that one first, but you can definitely get by with this. If you have any comments or questions, please put those down below. And if you found this video interesting and informative, please give it a thumbs up and help support my channel. That's it friends, thanks for watching. See you next time. If you like this video, I think you might like Fielder videos over there to the right. Click on those. And if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, hit that button down below. Also, if you want to see what I'm up to during the week, please connect with me on Twitter and Instagram. All right, friends. Enjoy.